Off the top at six and only on 10, surveillance video showing the moments before a mother was run down in the middle of the road. The driver never bothering to stop, leaving her for dead. The victim's family is devastated and demanding justice. Let's get right to Local 10. Ian Margle live in Pompano Beach with this exclusive. Ian. This is a 39 year old woman with two young daughters. She was walking across the street on power line right here behind me this past weekend. And the car that hit her never stopped. Somebody needs to pay for what you did to my sister. Desperation from a South Florida family after a fatal hit and run in Pompano Beach over the weekend. Rihanna McTagg says her sister, Karina, died after she was hit by a car on Powerline Road early Sunday morning, and the driver of that car never stopped to help. If they would have called 911, she might have been saved. She laid alone in the street in pain. Karina had just moved back to the area from St. Augustine. On Saturday, she spoke to her mother around 8 p.m., but no one heard from her after that for days. We don't hear from her at all. Her phone's going straight to voicemail. She doesn't come around for the 4th of July. They filed a missing persons report and then on Thursday learned what had happened to her. It turns out late Saturday into the early hours of Sunday, Karina was with a few friends at the Gold Club Pompano, but left. Around 2 a.m. you can see her in this surveillance video sitting on the curb at Powerline Road and Northwest 21st Street before getting up and starting to walk across the northbound lanes. She disappears behind some trees and then about 10 minutes later we see police blocking the street and Pompano Beach Fire Rescue pulling up to the scene, but it's unclear exactly which car hit her and when. Now Karina's two daughters, a 9 year old and a 15 year old are without their mother and her family is desperate for help finding whoever is responsible. Anybody that might have seen it, uh, anybody that might have heard anything, if you have security cameras over there on, on that road, please call the police and let them get those security cameras so they can identify who did this. The family absolutely devastated. They have set up a GoFundMe to help raise some money for those young girls and also for things like funeral expenses. If you'd like to help, we have a link to that on our website, local10.com. And if you know anything about this hit and run that can help find the person responsible, call Broward Crime Stoppers at 954-493-TIPS. Live in Pompano Beach, I'm Ian Margle, Local 10 News.